everyone, my name is Amanda and I'm the Fun Size Reader and welcome to the August 2022 Fun Size Book Club announcement. Hopefully you guys enjoyed Stealing Infinity which was July of 2022's pick but now I'm really excited to talk about the book that I wanted to choose for August. So here's the thing, I'm doing something slightly different for August, just slightly. Okay, just slightly. There are a lot of books coming out in August that I really want to read. The first one is obviously The Final Gambit. If you haven't read The Inheritance Games yet, please go watch my videos on them. They're so good. And the third and final book is coming out at the end of August. The other is Light Lark by Alex Astor, and that's coming out on August 23rd. Because both of them are coming out at the end of the month, I couldn't choose either of them for book club. So I had to do something a little bit different. So I still will be reading those and I will be getting my videos out to you guys as soon as possible. But if you want to have live discussions about those, because like obviously the inheritance games we've been waiting for and Light Lark is like, super up and coming. I definitely will put those as lives if you guys want. So let me know in the comments if you do. But the other different thing that I'm doing for book club for August is I'm picking a book I've already read. And the reason I'm doing that is because I want to read it again. I, I've been wanting to read this book again all year so far. And I was like, I was struggling because there were new releases that were coming out for August that I wanted to read. And, but they were all at the end of the month. And so I was like, why not? Why not read it? I know a lot of you have been interested in the book because I made a video a couple months ago about fantasy series to read after or besides Akotar. And I love this book, you guys. I love this book. And that is Air Awakens by Elise Kova. I have physical copies of all five of this series because I freaking loved it. And that's why I want to read it again. I will warn you though, every book leaves off on a cliffhanger. Okay. So if you are into it, be prepared that you're going to want the next book right away. <laughs> I did. Um, I made the mistake of not ordering some of them before I was finished with the one I was reading. And then I had to wait and it was just, awful. I, it was, the, the waiting was awful. But this, I believe, is like a new adult fantasy. It does have a lot of steam. It does get a little spicy from what I remember. Not this, maybe not this one immediately, but like the, the series as a whole. I'm, I'm struggling to remember what happened in each book, which is why I want to reread them. But I love Elise. I love her fantasy worlds. I love her characters. I love the fact that she is not will, not no holds barred on giving us tons of emotions as you read. So like, I really want to share this book with you guys. It's also available on Kindle Unlimited. All, the, the whole series is. So if you have KU, you can read it. It's, it's there. But if you don't, I will put the link in the description down below so you can order it and read along with me because I just love this series so, so much. And I just wanted to read it again. So. I'll be reading it on my Kindle just because it's been easier for me to read on my Kindle recently. If you want the book, trust me, you want the book. Let me read the synopsis for you guys. The Solaris Empire is one conquest away from uniting the continent and the rare elemental magic sleeping in 17 year old library apprentice Vala Jarl, Jarl could shift the tides of war. Vala has always been taught to fear the Tower of Sorcerers, a mysterious magic society that Anne has been happy in her quiet world of books. But after she unknowingly saves the life of one of the most powerful sorcerers of them all, the Crown Prince, Aldric, she finds herself enticed into his new world. Now she must decide her future, embrace her sorcery, and leave the life she's known or eradicate her magic and remain as she's always been. With the powerful forces lurking in the shadows, Vala's indecision could cost her more than she ever imagined. You guys, come on, please read this book with me. I'm looking forward to August. I really want you guys to love this book as much as I do, the series as much as I do. And I will put everything in the description below. But don't forget, if you do want to read along for the final gambit, 
for Light Lark, and there's probably others that I'm forgetting off the top of my head right now. Let me know in the comments so that I know to set that up as a live discussion and then I'll announce it and all of that. So excited to read Air Awakens with you guys. I hope you love it. And don't forget, you can also find me on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok at The Fun Size Reader. See you guys next time.